Hello, my dear children. Good morning, all of you. Today, for class 12, differentiation of first order. Here is little introduction. Roughly, if I divide the first order, then we'll get three different parts. First, implicit function, composite function, parametric function, inverse function, logarithm function, or one function with respect to another function. Today, only two among this I will explain. See the board. You must pay your full attention. Composite function, that is function of function. Example, cos into sine x square. How will you get the solution? By chain rule. Next, implicit function. Two variables, say x and y, is given by an equation that is x square plus 2xy minus y square. Differentiate each term of the equation with respect to x. You have to differentiate with respect to x. Implicit function, if you think, is going on. How? When you are looking the video, that means you are trying to understand. That means understanding is an implicit function of observation. So naturally you will get interest. On these two functions, one example is given here. That is, if log x square plus y square equal to 2 tan inverse y by x, so that dy by dx equal to x plus y by x minus y. Both the function you will get in one sum. So, you must pay your full attention. Solution. Log x square plus y square equal to 2 tan inverse y by x this. Differentiating both sides with respect to x we get. More step I am showing you for your easier understanding. Log x square plus y square equal to d by dx 2 tan inverse tan inverse y by x this now we have to differentiate with with respect to x that means the implicit function is reflecting here and when we we'll differentiate this function then you will get the hints of composite function see by differentiating log that is 1 by x square plus y square. This part again you have to differentiate that is by chain rule. This is the composite function. This. Next, 2 will come outside of the differentiation. Tan inverse. Differentiation of tan inverse that is 1 by x square. That is 1 plus y by x whole square. And here also you have to apply the chain rule. This you have to differentiate by chain rule d by dx y by x. This. In both sides we have applied 
the chain rule that is composite function now see 1 by x square plus y square we have to differentiate this by differentiating x square that is 2x and here the implicit function we have to differentiate with respect to x this is why it will come 2y dy by dx with respect to x this is why this is coming now by simplifying this we are getting 2 x square by x square plus y square into you have to differentiate this u by v method that is x unchanged differentiation of d by d x y and minus y unchanged differentiation of x that is 1 by x square so now we have to simplify that is in right side left hand side x square plus y square in right hand side also x square plus y square it will be cancelled then x square and x square that also will be cancelled after cancellation see the simplification what is coming now we may take common 2 from here that is x plus y dy by dx and here this 2 and x square x square cancel so x into x dy dx minus 1 up to this i think you are feeling comfort now see 2 and 2 will be cancelled so after interposition see y dy dx this will come coming from right to left so x dy dx equal to minus y this is minus x now we have to take common if you take common then y minus x dy by dx equal to minus common y plus x so by simplification i may write this minus x minus y dy by dx equal to minus x plus y minus minus we may cancel therefore dy by dx equal to x plus y by x minus y that is the right side so it is proved up to this if you do then you may expect the full marks now you must remember any difficulties if you feel then this is the advantage of video class that particular point you may observe repeatedly by looking up your difficulties not only will removed you will get internal pleasure also which is ultimate target of human being okay thank you everybody